director John Singleton has died. I got nominated for an Emmy. I, I guess I got to take this directing stuff seriously. E.T. can confirm that the Emmy and Oscar nominated director was taken off of life support on Monday after suffering a stroke earlier on April 17th. The 51-year-old grew up in South Central LA and graduated from USC School of Cinematic Arts. Singleton became the youngest director and first African-American writer-director nominated for an Academy Award for his film debut, Boys in the Hood. South Central Los Angeles, a place where drugs, crime, and violence rule the streets. Just the fact that the film is really still relevant today and, um, you know, I'm honored to, you know, have been a part of it and, you know, it was really my graduate thesis script at USC and, you know, the part of history and, you know, there's many more films to do me now, you know, it started my career. His groundbreaking look at South Central LA starred Cuba Gooding Jr., Angela Bassett, Lawrence Fishburne, Regina King and Ice Cube. Singleton's credits also include Too Fast, Too Furious, The People vs. O.J. Simpson, Billions, and Empire. It is what it is, The People vs. O.J. Simpson. It's, it's the story that America is constantly intrigued with. His latest project, Snowfall, was renewed for season three on FX last year. Singleton is survived by his mother, Sheila, father, Danny, and his five children.